Today, Kevin and Andrew and I are going to be trying this Anthon Berg collection. Kevin and I found this at Costco. It was $15.99 and we thought, you know, these are out for the Christmas. Yeah, they're out for the Christmas season and we thought it would be cool if we bought it and show you what you get and that way you know if, if you're interested in it for yourself or if you want to give it as a gift. These, uh, Anthon Berg is well known in Denmark. Uh, so these are dark chocolates. Uh, there are 64 pieces it says with genuine spirits. Yeah, it actually has alcohol. You actually you have to be 21 years old to. That's the real reason. To buy the to get this. <laughs> that that's is way so cool. that's way better done than What's some of the other ones. Filter back on this one. Oh, I like that. They're like a little shop. That's way better done than some of the. Oh, you only get four of each. No, there's double. There's oh, there's two. Uh, we, we, I was thinking eight of each. Okay, so. No, there's two. Yeah, there's, yeah, there's, there's two, two layers. Deep. So where do we go? We're going to be so doing I'm gonna, one each. I'm going <laughs> to pause right now, and I'm going to take a quick picture, and we'll be back. Okay, we're back. Um, it says two pieces. I guess two bottles are 150 calories. So we're going to be having some calories. 150 for two. So you... Yeah. Maybe you need to have it. You need to have it up right. Okay. I want to show it on. You pull it out and it has this little cap, uh, plastic cap on top. Okay, so this was like laying on top, just like coming together. You just want to try these first? Sure. And we'll check we'll straight bourbon down. whiskey. I don't want that one. It's got a ding top. Yeah, this is a Jim, Jim Beam. Beam. Okay. Which so one? You're, you're supposed to unwrap them. Unwrap it from the bottom. Like Andrew said wrap it from the top. Just, oh, I didn't see if there was a little tile on the bottom. There's a tile on the bottom? No, there's a little nubbin. Oh, there we go. You can tell this is new. I just not want to come unstuck. Okay. Mine is completely unwrapped. I yeah. won! I won! Yeah. Well, we're not as into alcohol as you. <laughs> yes. Right. Yes. So you're supposed to turn them upside down. Okay. And bite the bottom off. Throw them in a ship. Yeah. <laughs> bite the bottom off and then drink. Damn. <laughs> what? We bit the bottom off and you went bam. <laughs> you just slammed it. Me and him were just sitting here looking at it. <laughs> That's really good. That is much, that's got as about as much liquid as a uh, cherry cordial does. Mm -hmm. I was thinking less. Maybe even a little less. It's not much. I like the flavor of it though. Mm -hmm. The dark chocolate isn't very, it's not bitter. Oh God. You really helped out too. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. I like the flavor of the chocolate and the liquor together. That was very, very nice. Jim Beam is good stuff. I didn't expect that to be, have that uh, good of a flavor. I haven't had alcohol in so long. The warmth is comforting. <laughs> okay, you can say the name of this. <laughs> coin Thorough. I would have said Coin Thorough. Coin Contre. Coin Through. C O I N T H E A T R E A U. It's a specialty of France. Does it say what kind of liquor it is? It just says liquor. It's just liquor. All it matters. It's just that's what it says. It's just liquor. Now, would you put these on a table at a party? Is that what you would do with these normally? Mm -hmm. Would you set them out like like you know when we do Christmas Eve, we do little like appetizers. Would you just set these on the table? That'd be and, cool. And just let people them, set them out and let people pick what they want. Do you think Billy would go for one? <laughs> that's um, Kevin's dad. Yeah, my, dad <laughs> my dad. My dad likes like barbecue balls and stuff. So. She goes again, just slamming it. <laughs> Don't like them. We need to recreate. Like, keep this off them. Okay. I have my opinion. Ooh, that's like rubbing alcohol. That's like straight cough syrup. Mm -hmm. Literally, I feel like I just took my medicine as a child. Ooh. That's awful. I, I agree. The rubbing like alcohol, alcohol cough medicine. Yeah, I didn't like the red one. But no. I did like the Jim bourbon. Beam. Jim Beam's. Got it going on. Mm -hmm. We're bourbon people. I, think, I was going to say, I think we're more <laughs> used to that in our area. Well, we got to be. Okay. 
Tour this the, one, Andrew, what are these? This is a Canadian Club whiskey. Yeah, Canadian Club whiskey. Oh. So this this will be good. Hey, I'm not even down with you. <laughs> oh. With the taco. Well, we don't have to drink. We don't have to eat the taco part if you don't want to. I'm going to. I'm all in. I'm 100% or nothing. You're not first, you're last. We've seen these for years at different places. I um, remember working at Pace in Lexington. And it was a warehouse, like, like Sam's Club or Costco. Slipping in the back and drinking. And No, I mean, the, these were sold every Christmas, and they were always sold out. And I always wanted to try them, but I never did, because they were too I expensive. mean, it's probably, you know, a step up from the people who bought the rubbing out all the take home. Yeah, that one was pretty strong. <laughs> I thought I was funny. I can't. Oh, you know. I'm struggling so hard. Why do you? Why did you taste that? <laughs> what? I'm struggling. I'm struggling so hard. Oh, wait a minute. No, did you? I just got on. I couldn't get the dinger out of its package. <laughs> oh, that splashed. Oh, Andrew lost some of him. Lost some of my coat. You need to drink that. Um, that one. Uh, Hmm. I couldn't taste it. I could, but I did not like that near as much as the... Gone. Um, <laughs> I still didn't like it as much as the, the oh, Jim Beam. Yeah, Jim Beam's pretty good. The Jim Beam is just, that's beating everything right now. And that was Canadian Club. That was okay. It was, it kind of still reminds you of rubbing alcohol it a little did. bit. It did. But had, it had a little bit more of a woodsy kind of oaky flavor. It wouldn't be my choice. No. This is uh, Galileo. Galileo. Start something with something. Let's see. This is wine. It really doesn't, it needs to be a list of what they are. That Jim It does. It does. Well, not a nice list. I need to for Jay Young. Galliano is a registered trademark of Galliano, Amsterdam, the Netherlands. I didn't tell That's all that. it says. I don't know what this is. It does not, it doesn't say. It, yeah, I wish they said if it was a whiskey or a. That's what I would suggest. A sherry or a They could put a piece of paper on the inside to tell you. Uh, give you a good description or put a better description on the back. Yeah, they could have even put it in, printed it on the inside. On of the, the box. inside. The cutest little suckers. They are cool. Okay. I like that one. I've tasted that before. I like that one a lot. I don't think it still has a little bit of a rubbing alcohol kind of yeah. flavor, but it has a better flavor aftertaste. Kind of reminds me of chocolate for Yeah, it still has a rubbing alcohol bent to it. That's my second favorite so far. No, I like that one. Dad, we got two more shots. Huh? I said we have two more shelves to go. <laughs> okay, this one. Remy Martin. Have you heard of Remy Martin before? Oh, mm -hmm. I've Remy had, Martin. I've had Remy Martin. Fine champagne cognac. Oh, champagne cognac. Mm, I've heard those words. Okay. <laughs> you mean cosmic? Cosmic. I'm just kidding. <laughs> I was going to say, that was awful. Christina called it Jagger. Oh. Jagger. Jagger. Yeah. <laughs> But it smelled like tiger. I sold you out. Mine had some kind of crispy nib nubbin on the end of it. Christina will probably never watch this video, so we it's okay. Okay, so Remy Mark. But she'll but she'll taste some of this liquor later. <laughs> I haven't even. I'm not even close. She's like ready to go. She ain't got it in her mouth. It takes me a minute to get the nubbin off. It does me good. Look, mine's died a little. Back to, back to, mm -hmm. <laughs> that was awful. Back to medicine. Not as, bad, not as bad as the first medicine. I don't want to eat the rest of that. I don't either. I'm getting to the point where I don't want to keep eating these bottles. I know. Um, I didn't eat my bottle. Yeah, get that little bag. We'll put it in the bag. 
I'm gonna drink the liquor out, but I'm not gonna. I'm not gonna eat the bottle. It's a lot well, of if it's, if it's a good, yeah, it's a good flavor. But if it's a real yeah, good that flavor. one wasn't good. That one was very, very uh, strong rubbing alcohol. Um, I just think vodka. it tastes like freaking medicine. I didn't think it was good at all. I like vodka. Dan's code vodka. I swear this is what we have in the refrigerator. You mean the cheap stuff? Dan's. I don't know. It's not Dan's code cheap. I don't know. I don't we know don't know, but I don't know what right now. No, it's not that. It was something else. You probably got shmirn off. Uh, no, that no, we do. It wasn't that either. Do you have it in the fridge right now? Yeah. It's in the freezer. It's up at the top. I don't know if you can get to it though. Yeah, you can't get to it. It's up at the very right. top in the back. Are you sure it's up there? Because I moved it out. I moved it out of the freezer and I put it up there. Oh. It's in the top shelf of that cabinet. Because it hadn't been used in like six barn. Barton. Yeah. Barton. It hadn't been used in like six months. I wonder. So I took it out of the freezer because it was taking up space. We don't have room for all that. As you all know, if you watch. If our you just get the all. bottom open, Andrew, you don't have to. If you're not gonna. Well, if you might want the bottle, but. Hey, Ray. I like that. I went for the fish pound. She didn't notice. She didn't care. What? Well, you went for what? I like this one. I do too. Mm -hmm. good. This is my second favorite. We just that, that dark chocolate. I know we're 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 killing half the thing here, but it's it's it, it, it's, it's so much. So well, much. what did I say? You eat two, and you it's 150 calories. Yeah. So, so we're basically just trying alcohol. So there was 150. Well, there was 150. And so we there are, was three we are, we are getting the chocolate off the bottom. Yeah. So we are getting the two flavors. Yeah, we're getting the chocolate with it. That well, is a good, the and it's a decent dark chocolate. That uh, vodka one, that was my second favorite one. I like that. Is that a little... Da, 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 da. What? Tequila. tequila? Oh, Lord. I haven't had tequila. Is that, is that what Tequila gold, baby. I haven't had tequila. Salsa? S-A-U-Z-A? Before you eat that, it? what's this one? I can't remember. <laughs> what's that one? There's a way to say it. More kidding? Yeah, he might. You know what it is? I don't want to eat that one. Drink that one. It says espresso. No, we'll say it. Okay. Divero Cafe if it, Espresso. If it's, if it's the one I think it is, it's good. We'll say it. Okay. okay. So this is the... I worked at the liquor bar for like six months. And Burger? they make you so try to keep them. They don't make you try them, but they ask you if you'd like to try anything you want. So you know to sell. So you know what to sell. So I... <laughs> there's many a nights I walk around the floor lit. <laughs> half lit. Half lit. Selling bourbon to people. <laughs> because... <laughs> Couldn't taste it. Mm. Very mild. I could taste it. Ooh, it has a little bit of that pepper. Kinda. I do have to say, the chocolates are all the same. Some of them go better with chocolates than the other ones. I, yeah, that one wasn't one that I would put with chocolate. Yeah, I was okay. It, I, I, did, I didn't care for that that much. All right. The tequila gold. Um, the it good, was strong. Um, if you put these out for a party, I think it'd be pretty cool. I do too, because people are going to sit here and do what we're doing. They're going to grab one that they like. Ooh, yeah. But, like, hey, well, I've heard of Jim Beam, or I've heard of that, or the champagne. Yeah. Let's, let's be honest. You're not going to put the Jim Beam on the table. <laughs> you're going to keep that you're one for yourself. You're going to keep, 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 keep it for yourself, because it's the best one in this box. It was the best one. Bourbon. You could put these in a little gift bag for them to take home. You could. You could open that up and separate them. Like a little birthday Giddy, gift bag. Goodie bag. A little goodie like bag. Gavin's birthday. Yeah. yeah, Gavin's birthday. The adult gift bags. bags. <laughs> Here's some adult gift bags. Okay. The duck one has a coffee flavor. A little bit. I do suck. But that rubbing alcohol is still right behind it. Yeah, I hate to say it. <laughs> I knew she did it. Almost every one of these, with the exception of maybe two or three, had a definite out rubbing alcohol kind of flavor. All right, so Malibu rum would have been a really good choice. Yeah. Well, Captain Morgan. I would have enjoyed would've rum. Would have been good. Um, a rum. A good rum would have been put some cracking in there. What's uh, uh, that's a good what's spice. the brandy? 
I always thought brandy and chocolate was supposed to go together. I don't know. I thought sherry. I bet you. I bet you. I bet you they have another box that's wine. So. Uh, they do be. have. They do have other boxes, but I don't know what's in them. I, it seems like the other boxes had some of these same things in them, mm -hmm. but then maybe some other things. The Jim so. Beam was the yeah. That's the, the remnants of the bottles. The Jim Beam them. was definitely the best one mm -hmm. in the whole box. Um, you know, it's worth. It. I still think it would be really good to get this for if you're having a party. Or like you said, I think that's an excellent idea. Gift bags. Think about that makes eight gift bags if you give everybody one flavor. Um, this would be a really, <laughs> I think it's a good gift to give to somebody. I, really I think good. it would be good to lay out at a party. Um, oh yeah. Yeah, that, that, was, that was fun. Mm -hmm. um, I hope you enjoyed uh, just uh, sitting here watching us try these chocolates. If you have bought this box yourself, and you have a favorite let us know in the comments which one was your favorite because all three of us agree that the gym bean was the mm -hmm. best and the chocolates are good too so. yeah the chocolate's very good chocolate so i hope you enjoyed the video and thanks for watching